Hey you guys, welcome back to my channel and I am so ecstatic to be telling you guys that I have my hormones. I have my hormones. I have my hormones. I have my hormones. Yesterday I was prescribed my hormones after my endocrinologist viewed my blood work. Everything was normal. I knew it was normal. I was just waiting for her to review it and she sent the prescription in yesterday and I went to go pick it up and I was so happy. I was so happy. I manifested this. I prayed for this and now it's mine and I cannot wait to be the woman the gorgeous stunning woman that i always been and i'm definitely going to be that now honey i'm just so happy right now i feel so at peace so content and i haven't even took my first pill and i'm going to be taking my first pill with you guys on camera um but before we get into that i'm going to be telling you guys what i'm going to be taking and what they're going to do to my body but yes you guys i did start off on pills my endocrinologist gave me um an option to start on different um, types of estrogen but I just wanted to start off traditionally like every trans girl does and get the pills because I feel like the me starting off on needles that's going to be too much and my emotions is going to be all over the place and I just didn't want my body to go through that until it's time to so I started off on the pills I will be taking estradiol two milligrams a day and you guys I will be taking sabironolactone as well I will be taking 50 milligrams of that and that is basically going to stop the production of testosterone in my body and it's funny because when I was looking at my blood test results um my testosterone count was low and I googled that a lot of guys that look feminine or have feminine voices have low um testosterone in their body so that was a sign right there that I wasn't meant to be a boy, honey. Okay, period. But yes, that is what this has to, um, spinal relaxone is going to do. Now, the estradiol is going to basically, I'm going to read a couple things off this list. The things that it's going to do and the things that I will experience. I will have dry and thin skin, smaller pores, and less oil production, more prone to be bruising and cuts. My odors of my sweat and urine will change. Um, the way I feel things, my perception of touch will change. And the last thing that I want to mention is that I will be growing breasts as well. So like I said, if you want to see more on what the hormones are going to do for me, I will be linking a video in the description box below so you guys can go over there and watch that video. But I have been doing my research, so I'm ready for anything and everything that comes with these hormones, even the emotional changes. But I don't think I won't be having um, any emotional changes because I'm already emotional already so I really don't think I'm going to see no emotional changes but you guys I am so excited and let's go ahead and take the first dose of um, my estrogen and also with my um, estrogen that I'm going to be taking I take that in the daytime and I take my spironolactone at night and with my um, estradiol I'm basically just going to be taking these women's complete multivitamin one a day um, right here you can see like the little bottle um, my endocrinologist recommend that I take these with my hormones so let's go ahead and get into it you guys so I have my water here oh my god I'm so excited yes let's take one of these these pills are so small I'm just gonna go ahead and put it I'm gonna show you how small they are they are they're tiny. This is how tiny the pill is. I don't want it to fall off. Okay, that's enough boots. Okay, I'm going to put the other one back. Ooh. Okay, it fell on the floor. Hold up, boots. Okay, I'm putting the first one in. Ah! Hold up, I'm excited. <laughs> Oh, let me make sure it didn't go in this water. Okay, bitch, I just took my first hormone. Ah! Okay, it's not in the bottle, bitch. I had to make sure it wasn't in the bottle, bitch. And now we're going to go ahead and take my multivitamin. I really hate, I wish the hormone pills were were this size instead of that tiny shit because, bitch, I don't know 
I'm going to double check again to see if I actually swallowed it because I didn't feel it go down my throat. But once again, it's tiny, so I will not feel it go down my throat. But I'm going to go ahead and take my multivitamin. And there you guys have it. I have officially started transitioning as of Friday, August 28th at 12:24 p.m. in the afternoon you guys oh bitch i feel different i feel like my mind changing i feel like my ass is getting excited let me <laughs> let me stop um all right you guys it is official but let me say something bitch i feel different i don't know if it's the happiness coming over me but I really feel different that I just took that pill. Y'all probably like Mercedes, bitch. You're not feeling nothing now, bitch. I literally am feeling something. I don't know what it is, but I guess I'm just fucking happy. But yes, you guys, I am so happy to be finally starting my hormones. And, bitch, I really feel different. Like, I just took that pill and I feel different already. Like, I'm not even being funny. I don't know if it's just me having the peace and calmness and, you know, closure that I'm on my hormones now. But, bitch, I'm just, I just have this feeling that I haven't felt in a long time. So, I'm very excited. But I want to thank you guys for watching. Watching. and make sure you follow me on all of my social media so you can keep up with me and thank you guys for watching bye